somewhat test for Farming Simulator 22. And this before us is the Greenhouse and Nursery by Gwendal. 22.58 megabytes to download. It is a pack of four items or four placeables, three greenhouses. Well, I'm going to call them three greenhouses <clears throat> and a sell point for the products that are produced in these particular greenhouses. Now, first of all, we will find them under productions <clears throat> and greenhouses, and there they are. The very large greenhouse is there. That is 10 slots. The shrub greenhouse is 11 slots and $40,000, as you can see. And uh, the third um, greenhouse, I guess you could call it, is plants, $50,000. That is seven slots. We'll show you that. And the third item is a selling point. And there it is, plants and flowers. Looks like thus. Uh, $5,000. That is, uh, hold on to your hat, 23 slots for that. So, I kind of understand why with all this, uh, I mean, I do believe every plant is represented here and more probably. Curious thing about this cell point is the has the trigger marker here, but the actual area is here. We're going to test that out for sure. Mm, so the first greenhouse is the very large greenhouse. It will produce tomatoes, lettuce, strawberries, red cabbage, and flowers. I have flowers turned on. If we look at the recipe, they are all... 1,536 cycles per month. Each one of them are the same. <clears throat> and the uh, output is one per recipe. So 1,536 um, liters per month of production for each one. The recipe differs just slightly, but the only thing that differs in the recipe is actually the amount of water. Now you notice after one month, our water, seeds, and fertilizer is what it will take. They have went down roughly about half, maybe a little less. And we have 295 liters of flowers plus uh, uh, 2,000 liters here. So that roughly adds up uh, to my <laughs> calculations there. Uh, inputs are... Uh, I believe this is the fertilizer, seeds, yes, seeds, and water. This, the water container, there's one at each end, apparently. So, that's nice. Uh, spawn area is quite large, as you can see, it's all the way out here. So, that's, um, that's kudos to the water there. The next one is the shrubs. <clears throat> Uh, come on, there we go. Shrub greenhouse. So that plant that that will produce either bamboo or aloe vera, and as you can see, that is 1,200 cycles per month, one per cycle, and see aloe vera uses slightly less, 0.1 liter uh, of fertilizer less in the recipe. As you can see, the recipe has gone down, or the our, our, our product has gone down about a, a quarter to a third or less. We have 191 liters of bamboo plus uh, five, a thousand. So we have a thousand here, just over a thousand. Yeah, so that's 1,200 cycles. We have... Uh, 1,192 liters produced, so very close to that. And last but not least is, well, this is the plants. Now I have bonsai growing here. And if we look at the last one, we can bonsai, cypress, or eucalyptus. And those, they all have exactly the same recipe. One and a half water to a half 
No seeds in this one. 2,400 cycles per month. And um, yeah, so water's gone down. So plenty of, so now if, if you've had them all turned on, of course, it's gonna use, uh, you know, three times the amount of water and so forth. This is what it looks like when it is here ready to pick up. I do believe there's two pallets here of 385 liters each. And what do we say? They have uh, 385. Oh, so this is, it will only, the spawn area is quite small. This is the spawn area here. Uh, it says there's another one ready to spawn. Oh, it goes out to here though. It's a little vague, really. Uh, if you ask me, it is, hmm. 386 this is oh it's a thousand liters sorry I'm looking looking at the bottom at the top there's 2,000 liters up there and there's a 386 liter uh, in storage waiting to fill an entire um, thingy yeah right okay so what I'm gonna do now <clears throat> is I'm gonna go and refill everything so you know what the capacity is because I didn't there's a bunch of them so hold on well, I thought I should show you where the uh, products go in, so that's probably a good idea. That's fertilizer going into the um, plants, um, and then there's the water. We'll show you the water. The water goes in here. We'll show you the water on each one of these. Um, so that's a fertilizer. I'll, I'll, I'm going to dump this out and fill with seeds because both of them take seed. You want to see the fertilizer, fertilizer, 10,000 liters of fertilizer in the plants. So I zip over here and get some seeds. Do, 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 do. Oh, going the wrong way. Seeds. There we go. Now I'm using this small trailer just to show that I usually have a really big trailer. But anyways, here's the seeds on the large greenhouse here. They just correspond. The uh, trigger area is pretty generous, even though it is a tad small. And so seeds corresponding to the seeds over here. As you can see, just like so. Right. Of course, they didn't take much. They weren't down that much. If we take a look at our... Capacities, we have uh, 2,000 seed, 2,000 fertilizer there, the shrubs, uh, two and two, and the bonsai, uh, 10,000 liters of solid fertilizer, so a lot more there. And whoops, now let's go to our water tank. I'm just going to use this big one here. Um, and we're going to test out that back water tank because I filled it up on this one here, but let's make sure this one works. If I don't run into something, uh, right, okay, come on, little fella, there we go, so water going in there, uh, if we look at our productions, uh, water is 5,000 liters of water, and let's just spin around here, this is the plants, there we go, oh, there we go, water going in there that is our plants and that holds 9,000 liters of water and last but not least is our shrubs and there we go as I said very generous and the shrubs hold 5,000 liters of water now our next test is getting these uh, getting these items loaded up uh, without using a forklift because they're too heavy to lift so we have flowers here and we have the global what is it called again lizard global goods global goods transport palette by a2 studios and we have the our lizard logistics big bag trailer by rally christy one that i always use but this is kind of new for me because 
it should um, be able to load um, come on drop drop it drop it there um, does it is it loading I don't know uh, that's that's something well, okay come on detach that let's see if it loads if I use this so no it doesn't auto load those it doesn't auto load those so I've been asked a few times whether the uh, the global goods palette works apparently it doesn't work for this one but I'm pretty sure that this uh, this one has worked for every single one that I have tried up to this point, and it has not it has not uh, disappointed me yet. As you can see, it is loading the flowers quite nicely, and uh, so there we go. Right, so it. it We'll try it on the others quickly, but I have every reason to believe that they uh, will work. Now let's see if it just automatically, if we can automatically, yeah, so look at that. Let's look at our prices now, since we're selling stuff. What are the sell price for all these products? And the extra products is the red cabbage, flowers, bamboo, aloe vera, cypress, eucalyptus, eucalyptus and bonsai uh, red cabbage what do we got there plants and flowers is giving us about ooh, a little bit less than the sell everything price at uh, thirty two hundred dollars not great I'm on easy economy same with the flowers bamboo is not all that great either neither is the aloe vera cypress eucalyptus and bonsai they all they all are around that three thousand dollar mark which is hmm, somewhat disappointing if you ask me uh tomatoes and lettuce yeah the lettuce is actually good price tomatoes and strawberries not so much um yeah Sue, let's just sell it. There we go. Can sell it. Let's make sure we can collect the others. So, not a lot produced per month, and the sell price is somewhat. Uh, oh. Ah. Okay, so the. Oh, there we go. We got shrubs. We got shrubbery. It's loading. Yep. So it's loading. So that works with that one. And we can sell the bamboo. One last one to test. So it looks nice. Uh, is it profitable to a great degree? I don't know. I don't think so. It doesn't seem like you get a lot even though it sounds like a lot and there's the uh, bonsai loading up as you can see it there right so make sure we can sell that I'm well at this point it's pretty much a given and there we go and yes so that is pretty much all there is to that uh, if you have any questions I would be happy to answer them if I could and um, thank you all for watching that's the greenhouse and nursery by Gwendol 22.58 megabytes to download 10 11 7 and 23 slots for the sell point although it seems like the sell anything point uh, gives you just as good a price. So anyways, 
thanks again for watching. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game, so till next time, bye for now.